For thousands of years, mankind has been staring into the sky and wondering, are we alone? In 1992, NASA launched the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence program, in short SETI, to find alien civilizations in the deep cosmos. Radio telescopes were set up to detect signals from the space. However, in order to analyze the large amount of data received by the telescopes, enormous computing powers was needed to cover greater frequencies ranges with more accuracy. Yet, the computers located at the telescopes are far from enough to take on such an ambitious project. In 1999, more than radio SETI projects like SETI at Home were launched where the sharing of computing power became possible. The invention of volunteering computing means anyone can donate part of their computer storage space and processing power to analyze a small portion of data for a giant program. This is why in 2018, we launched Anchor, a distributed cloud computing platform that allows anyone with a computer to contribute their processing power to scientific researches and enterprises. In return, participants get rewarded for their contributions. Anchor is building a fast, decentralized compute platform on blockchain with a proof of useful work consensus protocol. In layman terms, they are using uh, computational power to solve real distributed tasks. The technical concepts are compelling, we like the idea, and we are very happy to support Anchor. So there's a couple of factors where what Anchor is doing is potentially very important for Boink and volunteer computing. Um, the first is how to incentivize volunteers. This whole rest of the world who needs something benefits them directly. The other interesting thing about what Anchor is doing has to do with trusted computing. People at Anchor have researched this idea of using these new hardware extensions on modern processors that let you compute in sort of an isolated environment where the owner of the computer cannot look at the memory, cannot see what's going on inside. When we get back the answer, we know that it is actually the correct result of running that program on that data. And the data is kept secret inside this protected domain. That's something that I'm very interested in working on with Anchor in the future. The reason why we really like uh, the Anchor team is because they've really thought about you know, how to build community. And the fact that the team and the project is thinking not just about uh, domestic use, but about international use and international growth. As you are going public, is basically building community, building community all across the world. We think that it can provide privacy, we think that it can provide uh, efficiency, and we think it can provide a much better way of, of doing many different types of applications. And so, you know, the fact that Anchor is using trusted hardware, you know, we think that they are pioneers in that type of technology. We're really excited about the future potential of Anchor. What we're trying to do is to enable everyone to be part of something greater. Imagine a world powered by all of us, rather than large centralized data centers. We can all be part of the change, regardless of our occupation or location. We also see huge potential for Anchor in providing universal basic income, where anyone with a working computer can earn money simply by utilizing idle resources.